Hey YouTubers, Jared here. Tonight I'll be uploading a gameplay from one of my favorite games from the mid 2000s. It's called Lord of the Rings The Battle for Middle Earth Rise of the Witch King. Now, to be fair, I have not played this game in a long time, so I might be very rusty. Or I may not be. We'll find out. Um, and on an added note, at the moment I do not have the right equipment per se to do like some of the really good gaming like what you see with people like Blasters HD, uh, Dance Games, Markiplier, uh, etc. But uh, for the future, if I get more subscribers and views of my videos, I will be working towards that goal. Now, if you guys, anyone who watches this video, or any of my gameplay, or whatever I put in my channel, which will be in the link in the description down below, please like, comment, subscribe, because uh, it really helps the channel out, it helps me out, I want to try to be kind of a big YouTuber, or at least a semi-good good YouTuber. I didn't think this through. <laughs> well, anyway, I apologize for any lag there might, that there might be, or graphics, or whatever. So, that being said, let's get into it. Middle Earth enjoyed a thousand years of peace after the ring was lost, and the death of Isildur. But Sauron was not dead, only cast to the shadows. In time, evil once more began to move. Arnor, the North Kingdom of Men, ruled by the heirs of Isildur. This land of passion and promise is waylaid by men's inability to set aside petty differences. And so it was that civil strife weakened the Dunedain and broke the land into three realms. Rudor, the smallest and weakest of the Dunedain kingships. Cardolan, guardian of the ancient Barrow Downs, where the forefathers of the Dunedain lay entombed. And Arthedain, the most powerful of the northern realms, still ruled by Isildur's heirs from its capital at Fornost. It was during the reign of the eighth king of Arthedain that evil began to multiply in Angmar, a twisted, frozen land that lay north beyond the Etten Moors and home of the Black Numenorians. Among them, a sorcerer of great power arose, known only as the Witch King. He has taken up his Iron Crown for a single purpose, to destroy the Dunedain and their kingdom of Arnor. Before Arnor can be invaded, the Witch King needs a symbol to unite Angmar's proud and willful denizens. Legends say that here in ages past loomed a great fortress of the ancient darkness, its ruins dark and silent in the mountains. Rebuilding this bastion will secure the Iron Crown's dominion over the Black Numenorians and the Northern Troll tribes. Especially the Black Numenorians. 
Men whose dark loyalty is under fire for dominion, we must rekindle. What's this? A warrior troll who fights like a trained swordsman? He would make a useful servant, indeed. build our fortresses. We must reach the three building sites and clear them of any opposition. They may join us. First of the king's men. The blood has started to spill. The captive snow trolls here have joined us.
Men of Angmar! We move to strike! Move! The enemy is attacking our forces! The Iron Crown calls! Do not hesitate! The end has come for the West. Come forth. site and started building a fortress. is under attack. It might be useful. Don't let it fall. Never fall. 
have taken control of this Dark Iron Forge. We can use it to build stone throwers and upgrade our troops with Dark Iron weapons and armor. We have cleared a building site and started building a fortress. Don't let the trolls see you slacking. Here's more work for you lazy words. I roll gas. I go there. I go. I ready. I bring death to the west. We have finished building one of our fortresses. Come forth. A fire drake! Keep your distance! The Witch King's new fortress is complete! We're done with that one. Get back to work! The Dark Iron Forge has been expanded strong! Well, man, you cut! Dark King Mighty! I ready! I go there. We finished that one! I move! I go there. Enemy troops are near. I ready to kill! building a fortress. Weapons are ready.
I go there. Either your lives or your wills are forfeit. Choose now. Your will is ours, Dreadlord, now and forever. You are broken, but I will reforge you into a blade worthy of the Iron Crown. More the Iron Crown reigns supreme. Now all of Angmar is united under the Iron Crown. Legions of orcs fight under the command of the Thralmasters of Angmar. The great fortress at Khan Doom continues to rise. It will make an ideal sanctum for the Witch King to work his fell sorcery. The hammer is forged at last, ready to smite the heirs of Elendil and lay their kingdoms low. <laughs>